All right, y'all, what's up? Here is a follow-up story to the reports on Lana possibly stepping into Eva Marie's so-called gimmick. All Red Everything was a glamorous display of feminism. When Eva Marie portrayed her character the few times she got on WWE uh, television with the gimmick. Most of the gimmick was all hype with promo videos. I uh, disagree. There was no hype, and she couldn't cut a promo to save her life, as we all know. But once she debuted, she was poised to be on the top of the female roster. Oh, hell to the no. There was no chance in hell of that happening. She couldn't get over an NXT. So what the fuck makes you think, or what made Vince McMahon think that she was going to get over on the main roster? I'll give the WWE Universe some credit. At least a lot of them can see through bullshit, much like us here in the YWC. But unfortunately, or fortunately for us, Eva Marie was popped with a wellness policy violation because they found a prescription for ADD medication that she's had for years, but she still lost a ton of steam, which led to her suspension and eventual hiatus from WWE. It was really a sad way to end something she had obviously worked hard for. Worked hard my ass. The only hard work she ever did, most likely, was in Vince's office behind closed doors. Or... Maybe some private sessions with some top WWE officials. I'll leave that to your imagination. I don't think she's. I don't think she, she's ever worked hard a day she was there. The only the only training we ever saw was with Brian Kendrick, and that was a fucking waste of his time. But another WWE a female talent, who I believe has no talent, all looks, and basically can't cut a promo and has a bad Russian accent, and you know who I'm talking about. Basically, she's the blonde version of Eva Marie, the so-called ravishing Russian, Rusev's wife. She popped up on television finally with a repackaged gimmick that is glamorous and ravishing. She was recently given a new gimmick and transitioned into a wrestling role. She immediately got a SmackDown title shot, women's title sh and she got the title shot because they had used every other woman on the roster in the first ever women's Money in the Bank ladder match. Now she has another shot at Naomi's title on Tuesday night. It's almost like WWE re rebooked one-fourth of the Money in the Bank pay-per-view for SmackDown Live this week. And on that, and just for the record, the pay-per-view sucked. For the most part, SmackDown uh, sucks. But that, goes, but that goes without saying. And some have said even Marie and Lana's gimmicks are way too similar for it to be a coincidence. Eva Marie recently appeared on the Wrestling Observer podcast where she plugged her upcoming film, Inconceivable, which stars Nicolas Cage and is due out Friday, June 30th. Along the way, the reporter asked All Red Everything if she thought the ravishing Russian was given her gimmick and angle due to her departure. And she, quote, and she said, I quote, You know what? I wouldn't say she got my role just because you can't really ever duplicate something that's not you. There's only one Eva Marie. Thank God for that. There's only going to be one Eva Marie. I think Lana is a very smart talent. I wouldn't say that because between her and Lana, there basically no IQ exists. Now, and just topped into something that she thought that she would kind of go ahead and get in there somehow. And I think that's kind of where she's at. As far as, far as if it was my storyline, I'm not quite sure. I didn't know my storyline that far in, in advance, but I'm not quite sure if that was mine or not. I'm going to say, let's hope not. That's a good point, but uh, either way, let's hope she doesn't come back. And if that and if that was to be even Marie's storyline, then Lana, your your career, much like Rusev's, is dead in the water. And I gotta tell you, folks, you know, Eva Marie just seems to Eva Marie just seems to leave a bad taste, a bad karma 
wherever she goes. And this will be the first ever gimmick that leaves a, a bad vapor trail on another woman's career that, that may not last too long. But wherever, uh, wherever Lana's career goes, uh, you be the judge. Anyway, uh, leave your thoughts and comments. Uh, like, share, and subscribe. Peace.